We're going to jump into the panel now. I'm, I'm happy to introduce uh, the co-founder and CEO of Game Lab, uh, veteran game designer, and I believe veteran panel moderator as well, uh, Eric Zimmerman. Uh, I'll let Eric introduce the rest of the panelists, but um, Eric Zimmerman, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks, Mike. Just give me a second while I, um, I nestle my, my cute little laptop inside the, the, uh, the lap of this, this big, big one right here. Um, I, I don't know if we want to disturb them now. They look pretty intimate. Um, all right. Well, first of all, you know, let me, let's, uh, let's give Wade a big round of applause for keeping uh, games going in New York, putting together events like this. Um, you know, it's just, it, Wade really just took over the, the chapter. Uh, this year, and I think it's pretty amazing. Already we've had a couple events with, you know, great attendance. All right, I think that's where we want to be. Okay, and um, also I'd like to thank David Allen. David, are you, I don't know if Wade recognized you earlier. I was in the restroom when he was talking, but can you just stand up? David uh, helped put this event together and did a lot of work for this, organizing this event, so I really appreciate it. So what is this about? What are we going to talk about tonight? Well, um, you know, last week, uh, last time we met two months ago, uh, the New York chapter, it was a sort of a demo night. It's really people sort of sharing games they're working on, emerging games, a, a lot of demoing of the games themselves. Um, the flip side of, of looking at the games in and of themselves is really talking about what it means to make games and to work on games in New York City. And I'm very excited tonight because we have assembled um, a really diverse and interesting smart panel of New York City based game developers that come from very different sectors of the game industry. People working on um, big multi-million dollar console titles, people working on handheld games, online games, uh, uh, games that take place off computers. So I think what we're going to get tonight is really a diverse set of experiences from, from this panel. The goal here is for these guys to help you out, right? I mean, this is not, they're not advertising their work. They're not showing up. We're here in order to help out the local game community and talk about what it means to make games in New York City. Um, we're going to start off by each of the panelists talking about a single project that they've done recently or that's going to come out in the near future. I guess some of them not so recently. Uh, but um, um, they're, we're going to go through a series of games. And then um, we're going to talk about, for each of those games that they presented briefly, um, uh, the design aspects of the game, what it means to make the player experience, the um, production aspect, what, what, what did they learn from the actual dynamics of, of putting a game together, the business aspect of the game, and also the cultural aspect. Who was the game for? What's maybe the larger significance of the game or things that they learned uh, from making the game about the culture of gaming in general? So it's going to be a pretty loose discussion and fast moving discussion. We can save Q&A to the end if any of you are really burning with a question, raise your hand and maybe we can pop it in as well. But I'm going to leave plenty of time at the end for, for question and answer. So I'm just going to introduce um, the panelists as we get to them. Their bios are in the, you know what, I'll just, I'll just go ahead and introduce uh, all of them. I just want to make sure I get all their titles right. Uh, on, the, on the far end, Ian Smith. Uh, from Freeverse Software, uh, Greg Kostikian is next, Manifesto Games, Frank Lance in the middle, manning the handheld mic uh, at Area Code, Jason Schreiber at uh, uh, Powerhead Games, and uh, right here on my left, uh, uh, sorry, did I, did I, Schreiber, Schreiber. Um, How many Yorker are you? <laughs> I, well, I'm, I'm not a native uh, New Yorker, as, uh, as Ian Smith evidently is based on his. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm from Indiana originally, all right? And proud. <laughs> uh, and Frank Lee's on my right, who is um, uh, from Chaos Studios. 